The Elizabeth Grove Community Campus is made up of several services. The Elizabeth Grove Primary School, Kids and New Family Services, which is a branch of the Women's and Children's Hospital, the Elizabeth Grove Children's Centre, which is long day care and preschool as an integrated service, the Good Beginnings Turnaround Program, which work from community development principles to deliver services to the community, um, as well as after school care. So that brings care, health and education all co-located on one campus. One of the great experiences of this place is it's like a tonic because you come along and you get to see the reality of the great services that are being provided and the support for the families and their children. When it's referred to as the community campus, that's exactly what happens. It has the early years focus, it has the primary school focus and then it has the parental focus. So you're actually dealing with all ages. We support parents to develop skills um, and we do a lot of cross campus and other agency work as well so a lot of our group work is done with Good Beginnings and with the school and with the children's centre so we try to look at programs that the community wants and um, work together so that we're not duplicating um, so that we can share our resources and so that the community can see we work together. Parents don't want to have to go here for one thing and 10 miles down the road for another thing. If they haven't got transport, it's hard. And also it's good for them to see that agencies work together. Our centre opens from seven in the morning um, till six in the evening. We can provide long day care for um, families and we also offer a preschool program. Our aim is to make sure that while the children are in our care that we provide them with the best possible um, opportunities in terms of their learning and their growth and overall development. So our focus is on providing a quality early childhood program where children learn through play and through quality interactions with the people that work here. What we look for at the campus is getting the kids engaged in school, getting them to attend to start with, so we need to work with families around that if there's issues. Uh, then once they're at school we need to make them feel secure so they're engaged in their work and then in turn that impacts on their behaviour if they've had bad behaviour in the past. We have a strong emphasis on literacy. Um, especially reading, and we have extra support in classrooms during that time. We're going to have a look on the blackboard at how we write an A, and then we're going back to our seats, we've got our whiteboards back there. We're going to clean them off, and we're going to see if we can do the best A's that we have ever, ever done. Back you go, back to your seats, I'll bring some dusters around so we can start. What we want is the best for our students, um, so we um, try very, very hard to uh, make our students reach their potential. And we understand that we have a wide range of students here and some of their strengths aren't entirely academic, so we need to balance that out with lots of other things that we do. Things that enable the children to find something that they can do and they're good at, and they enjoy and in turn they make friends with similar interests and then they feel comfortable at school. So that's what we look for. Hi, I'm Parom and I'm a year six. I'm 11 years old and I'm a senior at Elizabeth Grove School. I've got two hobbies, one of them singing and one of them dancing. Dancing I've been doing for three years and singing I've been doing for two. I just want to, you know, not always be at school just for work, I want to have fun and stuff. Because a graduate of Elizabeth Grove School, we hope, is a valuable member of society. The principal of Elizabeth Grove Primary School recognised a need for more services to be located on campus. That was when Good Beginnings was invited to work on campus and the turnaround program was established. Um, Good Beginnings is a national parenting program which is child focused. It began in 1997 um, and has programs right across Australia. There's 80 programs running at the moment. Um, we really value parents and communities and volunteers. The turnaround program is very community driven and any groups that the community may want is what we deliver on. Um, the groups that we have on a day-to-day -day basis are um, parenting groups, play groups, 
um, counselling for children and for parents, um, as well as female and male specific groups. When I started here, I was basically a single dad at home. Um, I'd come along here and uh, read to the kids at school for a while, and I got the opportunity to do some work, working with dads and, and working with uh, young boys. I was sponsored to go and do my diploma in counselling, so I've got my diploma in counselling, which I just completed at the end of last year. Oh, the effect it's had on my family has just been huge. Like, it's opened up new doors for me and it's given the kids stability. And my youngest daughter is disabled, she's just grown so much. When she started here, she was in a wheelchair. So that was just huge. She no longer is in a wheelchair, she's walking, um, becoming involved in the school and in the whole community and the TAP program especially. Um, it's just opened up new doors. I, it's taken my whole life in a different direction. Obviously what uh, we have here is uh, a set of services which is really uh, reflecting uh, politicians and MPs' ambitions for um, future service delivery in this country. It affects the community at large in a very positive way um, because um, the more we build up those relationships and networks, uh, the more knowledge people have about what government services are out there and also how to utilise them. So I think it, it does two things. Obviously it provides a service, but it also brings, up, uh, brings uh, the communities and families and individuals' knowledge uh, base up and, and creates that um, civic culture and civic uh, infrastructure that we need. The beauty of our campus and the people that we work with is their absolutely generous spirit um, and their willingness to work with us and let us work with them. The greatest gift you can give